Hi, uh, my name is Dan Parent, and I have been an artist and writer for Archie Comics uh, for the past 26 years. And I've worked on basically all the characters, Archie, Betty, Veronica, Josie and the Pussycat, Sabrina. We have a very big universe of characters that I've been, you know, loving working on all these years. And a few years ago, we had decided to um, expand the world of Riverdale, and um, we came up with the idea for Kevin Keller. And I had suggested trying a gay character to John Goldwater, who was our new CEO, and he was totally on board with it. So what I started doing was doing sketches of Kevin and coming up with sort of like a, a, a basic outline of who he was and where he came from. So we came up with the idea of him coming in from out of town with his family. They were a military family, so they moved around a lot. And we showed a, like a backstory of Kevin and how he, you know, wasn't always like the... Uh, the handsome high school kid that he is now. He had a lot of, you know, he struggled growing up. Uh, when we introduced Kevin in uh, Veronica number 202, it was the first Archie comic to ever to sell out in, in like 70 years. That's a good sign. <laughs> it's a sign that the character is gonna stick around or, or is starting out very well. But we didn't want it to just be like, this is the gay issue of Veronica and then just drop it and never come back to it. We were introducing a character that we really wanted to have some legs. So we worked very, very hard on the issue, probably harder than any storyline I've worked on. And, uh, you know, the, the readers responded really favorably. Another thing about Archie Comics, we like to promote a lot of things about positive, um, good family relationships, and uh, Kevin and his dad definitely are, are reflective of that. Yeah, this is the, uh, the cover where we introduce Kevin and his dad, and um, as you see, Kevin is saying, Dad, you're my hero, which is a, a lot of the thread of the storyline of the Kevin Keller story. So he really um, worships his dad, and his, his father's a very kind man who is very accepting of Kevin, and we have a really, really solid relationship. Kevin is based on really just um, sort of like what I've been witnessing just from what I see in like my kids' schools. Because um, at the time Kevin was created, my daughter was still in high school, and you know, she, it's a different culture than it was probably 10 years ago. You know, there's LGBT groups in her school, and you know, she would have friends over, and you know, this friend was gay, this friend was bi, and it was just not really an issue. So, um, so that was part of the crux of creating Kevin. And in addition, with we were looking to try moving Archie sort of into the 21st century at the same time. We're going to keep moving forward with his relationship and see where that goes. There's so much to explore.